Well, as I've said, there are several parties holding their spring conferences this weekend, and among them is the UK Independence Party. They're meeting in Exeter. Their leader, Nigel Farage, says the party will be actively targeting Labour supporters in upcoming local elections in England and Wales. Our political correspondent, Chris Mason, is at the UKIP Spring Conference in Exeter for us. So what are we likely to hear then, Chris? Yes, good morning to you uh, from Exeter. I only half heard your question then because uh, we have a uh, rather passionate speech going on on the stage behind me. Winston Mackenzie, who was uh, UKIP's candidate in a by-election in Croydon recently. The mood here is one of real buoyancy and optimism because UKIP have performed uh, very well in recent by-elections, came second in Eastleigh in Hampshire uh, last month, their best ever by-election performance with 28% of the vote. In four by-elections in the last couple of years for Westminster seats, they've come second as well. So a real sense from UKIP that they're on the verge of a big breakthrough. But it's worth emphasising they have no MPs uh, at the moment. They have no presence at Westminster. A reasonable presence uh, in the European Parliament with 11 MEPs there. Their next big push uh, comes with the local elections in England and Wales in May and then the European elections uh, next year uh, in 2014. In those European elections they hope to actually win. They came second last time. They hope to beat the Conservatives and win. That could prove quite interesting because if they would manage to do that they'd then start to make the case that they should take part in any leaders debates before the general election and that could uh, really shake things up. Chris, uh, for the moment we'll leave you there with the noise. Thank you very much.